Hello there dreamers and welcome back to another video this week we have a really exciting dream snap theme or at least I think it's really exciting I'm gonna have a lot of fun with it pretty much all decor dream snaps are something I really look forward to every week and this one is completely different from a lot of the themes that we've had before but we could always use more inspiration even though this week is probably going to be pretty easy I mean we have lots of options lots of items clothing options I mean there's just so much to do and there's a lot of like beautiful locations for the beach and I think we're all going to do really well this week. Now, if you guys do enjoy this video at all, please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. Let's go take a look at the theme of this week. So the theme is Moana's Village. So this makes me wonder, do we want to include Moana or maybe even Maui this week? I feel like I probably will. I have not done my dream snap yet or even attempted it, but I do think that I'm going to put Moana and perhaps Maui in my uh, dream snap. We're gonna head over to Discord and see what everyone has already came up with, see what they've been doing. And uh, yeah, just a decor challenge. You got calm and delicate. Make sure you hit these bonus tags on at least a couple items. So rustic and Moana themed items are gonna do really well. Other than that, yeah, just find a nice place. I will say the key to this week is going to be getting the sky perfect because the beach and sky, they go like hand in hand. You need it really beautiful. Pick the right filters. Uh, definitely get it. Just, just nail your lighting on this week. It's going to do really well. Probably lots of like torches like they have here. Melted candles, things like that are probably going to work very well also. Alrighty, wow. Okay, so I am uh, filming this on reset day. So it's only been about 12 hours, not even, it's been 11 hours since reset. And as you can see here, there are a lot of community members that have already finished this. So it, it hasn't even, it's still Wednesday when I'm recording this. Look at all of these submissions. I think it's because a lot of members already had their beach decorated. We have had beach themed decorations, uh, dream snaps, and uh, it's just an easier challenge. So let's take a look at some of them. If I don't click on yours, I promise you, I'm just picking some of these at random. It doesn't mean yours is better or worse. We're just going to take a look at some of these. Right off the bat, Cozy Cookie got in here with uh, one minute ago. Let's take a look. They said probably not my final submission. Oh, that's another thing. Some of these might not be people's final submission they're probably going to change them throughout the week so uh, just keep that in mind but i still like to pull some inspiration and get some ideas this one they said but wanted to share what i'm working on to me this looks like it is a final submission it is that good i could see this being top 500 without a doubt the lighting the filter that you chose for this is actually a really good theme you have your character in a beautiful stance it's not even an outfit challenge but you have it right here up close it looks really nice what is this is this like what that's not part of the dress right i don't know it's tripping me out i think it's something that's on the beach is it like the coral i don't know it's tripping me out but you should definitely go with it love these flowers you have the boat just sticking over here a little bit you even have the little pool leading up to moana's house got some tiki torches yeah, this is really beautiful. I cannot see people not clicking and voting on this one. A chummy decided to do a really interesting angle. So they have it look like you just took a picture of like a random the village as you guys are just interacting in it, which is really nice. It doesn't look like a setup or a scene. It just looks like you came up, stumbled upon the little village over here. Putting these little torches in the foreground is a really nice touch. I really love the colors on this. Like I said, the lighting is what's going to help you stand out in this week's challenge. Ooh, it looks like Laffy Taffy is changing theirs and they're probably going to change it a bit more. But here's their updated one. Uh, the colors are so cool. Look at the angle with the weeds in the foreground. You got the boat, Moana's house. Look at all the greenery using some of the expansion trees in this. And I really love how you have your character and Moana and Maui. That's it. I'm going to have both of them because I don't think I've ever used a dream snap with Maui in it. It's always risky, or at least I feel like, because uh, Maui gets a lot of hate. But I think I'm going to try for it this week. I'm going to include him in my submission because looking at this, this is just too perfect. Christian Henry absolutely killed it this week. Look at the Mickey cloud over here. You got Moana giving the side eye. Her and Mickey have got to be best friends because they're always giving everyone the side eye in the village. Uh, you have some of the fish. Uh, adding stuff like little crabs and stuff on the ground might work out really well too. I am curious if anyone's going to go like a pirate theme or not. We'll have to wait and see. 
they have some of the eternity isle flowers over here as well the illuminating trees is nice i'm also curious if anyone is going to do like a nighttime beach shot with a bunch of lights these illuminating trees i think that would work out really well oh wow talk to beth has a very up close shot they put tafiti steals pua First time I ever tore down my build after one submission. I love it. Was waiting for a good shot over two hours and then this happened right here. <laughs> you have Maui at the dinner table. Moana looks upset. Your character is super close. I think if you submitted this, you're gonna rank really high. Look at Pua, he's literally like begging for the votes. The whole village is set up very nicely. You even included the statue of Maui. Dang. <laughs> I'm curious to see what the results on this are going to be. Oh my gosh, there's just so many. Uh, let's see, they updated their submission over here as well. Sarah has nailed the color. Look at it. They did do like a nighttime sky, but as you see, their photo isn't like really dark. I, I love the little like green lights, and then you have lots of green trees and stuff. They closed this in so well. Sheesh. And then you have Maui and Moana over here, character with their back towards the camera. I think that's going to do well. Here, here was their original submission. Um, this looks really nice too, but something, I don't know. I just really like how cinematic this one looks. Definitely go for that one. Gemma over here has brought all the sparkles and lights. Oh, I forgot about these little like coral thingies here. They glow or I forgot what they're called. I think they start with an A maybe but they glow in the dark and then the sky they have it like almost sunset but it's also nighttime so their sky is like split 50 and 50. they got the illuminating trees yeah these little glows like the little tiki torches they promote like just a little bit of glow but it's like in such a way that it doesn't make the rest of the photo hazy but it's also really bright so i think those are going to be really nice too Pua seems to be something you need in your picture as well. I have to remember to put them on as a companion. I don't know. I don't think I'm going to hold them. I think I might just have Pua running around. Maybe include Stitch in the photo too. A Caroline Rose. Yeah, it looks like this is like the stance that many people are using this week. But it looks so good. Like, I, I don't know. I like how they just decorate like a full on uh, village here. And then it has like their characters just looking at their hard work. We got Pua over here. He looks like he's smiling. That's cute. All right, Wilma. I love the fog. I feel like it made the shot, but while Anna isn't facing me, might wait around for the, the fog like hardly ever shows up. I don't think you need Moana facing you, honestly. If you want to wait for it, definitely go for it. But I don't think you need it. I think she looks good like this, where she's kind of just doing her own thing in the, the village. Capturing this with the fog and the filter and the sun and everything looks really good and definitely makes you stand out. I've also noticed a trend. A lot of people this week are using this border right here, like the widescreen one. But you have your character in like the spa pajama outfit. Cute. I really love the lighting on this one. We got Raven Ranks going for selfie mode. Scars can heal and reveal just where you are. You may hear a voice inside. Let's take a look. Um, wow, Moana looks really good actually in this picture. I never really noticed her character design, but they actually did a really good job. High quality, the outfit and everything is really nice. If only Belle could get that treatment. Uh, character's cute. Oh, this is actually a really good thing to place too, like the whole fountain of youth which is in the premium shop this week i also like how you use these little like a wooden fence from eternity isle you know what i think for selfie mode i think you could really pull this off honestly we got unato 92 over here oh wow they also brought a lot of the glows and like sparkles they got a bunch of like the illuminating flowers some of the pots lots of wood items are always well placing these little like wooden boards look really good on the beach too and then you got the statue of maui i think we have seen pretty much moana in almost every submission right so i would say if you don't include moana you could be at a disadvantage but no one knows for sure obviously talon join us for a beach vacation i rather like this shot i might try again later to see if i can actually get moana in the middle of her idle dancing animation uh, I think that would be a good idea, you know, because uh, a lot of submissions seem to have just Moana standing there. If you could get her in a 
animation that's a little bit different than just for norm it's going to look good you also included the little turtles how cute a filter for this one nailed lighting perfect you got some shadows up here where they need to be shade and then you have lots of lights over here you got the bow in a perfect spot your character is all decked out in blue i love that and then you're holding pua this is a really good shot Nick's over here. Pua was being camera shy. He's hiding right in front of the pink flowers. Love Moana and would definitely love for them to add hee hee to the valley. Oh, wow. Okay, this is a very full shot and like the best way to look at the giant Mickey cloud. That's the great thing about the location for the beach is like I said, the sky is like half of the shot. So if you could get a lot of stuff going on in the sky, get a big Mickey cloud or something, or if you're doing nighttime, get constellation. I think it looks well. Uh, you have Maui's house over here. Um, you can place that in the water in the background. Then they got Moana's house, the statue, the little barrels are a nice touch. Got a couple of sparkles. Character looks so beautiful in that dress with the hair. Almost got Suro hair going on. Love it. Moana, they need to give her some more animations and facial expressions and stuff. They got to give her a revamp, but her character design does look good. She just looks kind of upset all the time. We got Black Winged Beauty. This is their first attempt, so they may change it up. But honestly, if they submitted this, I don't think they need to change it up. Look at their tags, 74 and 63. Oh, you got little Stitch playing. Oh, come on. That is the cutest thing ever. All right, that's it. I have to get Stitch in here. Maybe put a little coconut drink down on the ground by him. Getting him to play his instrument. Uh, Maui back here, Moana over here. Yeah, I kind of like when the villagers aren't really posed for the photo. They're kind of just doing their own thing here. Uh, you got the bamboo trees, which look really nice. It does seem like most are using Moana's boat, so I feel like that's an item we probably should include. But really nice. Character beautiful. Got the little turtle in there as well. We got Suemi over here. I love their submission. Um, I got the Fountain of Youth in the back on the little island. That's actually genius. I also love how you fenced in this area over here and you have like the little pool. You got Moana's hut back here. Moana in the picture, Pua. Outfit is cute. You even have these little like uh, mats laid out over here on the beach. And then you chose to do the boards on the beach, which I really do like. I think it's such a great idea. This is really cool. It's definitely a different take than we've seen some of the other submissions so far. I'm loving it. Guys, if you need some more inspiration, head over to the Discord. I mean, just look at some of these. We got Sven's over here. Pua right here in the front. They got their character sitting down at the table. That is actually so smart to have your character sitting down like that. You got to submit this. That is too cute. Uh, we got Ghostface over here. They have a really beautiful submission, a unique pose. Moana looking at their character, the lighting, Ariel's house in the background. I mean, these are incredible. We got Sunny over here. Look how cute and beautiful their character is. Got the little turtle, got some sparkles. Man, they have a lot going on. It just, this photo has tons of depth in it. Let's see, we got Ghostly Dragon Queen went for an indoor submission. They have some pretty high tags. It looks like 13 and 7 on this one. Kiki over here looks like they're still updating. Spiraled slightly to get Moana out of the shadow, so they're probably going to keep changing it up a little bit. This one looks really good. Yeah, you definitely don't want some of the characters like not having the light hit them, especially for a beach theme. Darling over here. It looks like they keep updating it. Got Mirabelle up here in the foreground doing her little animation. Maui back there looking at his own statue. Insane. We got Cricket over here. Really nice lighting. Love the background. Love the sun peeking out of all of the clouds. Yeah, this is why I can't include everything in the video. There's just uh, so many submissions. And they're all incredible. Like, look at the post. Who would have thought to do this? Like, seriously, this is so unique. Love how they framed it up on the side. You have the hut. You have the desert temple over here. And then I don't think I've ever seen a dream snap taking from this angle, looking towards the steps that lead to the meadow. They have Eric's house on this side, or his castle, I should say. Movie made in that they have an indoor submission with characters. Oh, wow. Okay. They got Tafiti. Um, characters from the film, they have lots of like the outdoor stuff set up indoor. Gotta have the statue of Maui. Seraph Wing, um, oh, I was just about to say this is a really incredible submission, but you should move your camera angle up to here. And uh, they already did, so this is perfect. 
I think this is incredible. You definitely have it framed up nicely. This first one, like I said, uh, sometimes when you have too much not going on in one spot, it won't get as many votes, but you fixed it, you know what to do, and you have a 4K submission right there. That is beautiful. Let's see, who else do we have? Uh, um, oh, wow, love the colors on this one. Moana up here in the front. Moana is always so sparkly too. A Loret, tags are 40 and 33. This one is gorgeous. I'm just trying to get through a lot of these because they're so good. We have another room submission. I don't know if room submissions are a good idea this week or not. It could be hit or miss. Um, this one's decorated, so it, like really nicely. It has a very high chance of doing well. Let's see. Oh, Catrus killed it. Come on. Um, Shiny Moon said this is stunning. 100%. Look at this. Oh, don't forget you can put these little like uh, glowing lily things in the ground. Uh, the water. I forgot what they're called. They got the big sky, the turtle, it's adorable. Jolly, okay, I'm having fun decorating for this challenge. I am turning my beach into a lush paradise. This is a rough draft. All right, let's see if they update a little bit. Um, they may still change it, but character, the green skin and everything looks perfect. The whole background is very heavily decorated in like the best way possible. Man, I am blown away. We got Nolan has a very incredible high quality submission. Like always oh, got the little companions up front. <laughs> love it. I love how they're like doing the same stance. They're like looking at each other. Look at Maui back here peeking through the little ice cream. <laughs> Alrighty guys, we are going to wrap the video up here. We got Sydney with a beautiful submission. Lots of companions. Pua. These are just great. But that's it for the video. I hope you guys have some inspiration or at least have an idea of what other people are doing. If you haven't joined our Discord, be sure that you do down below. I hope you guys have the best day ever and I'll see you in the next one.